Hey! Hey everybody, welcome back to our <laughs> channel. It's me, D. And T. Hey! <laughs> you guys know that we have gotten engaged and we have started our wedding planning process, mm -hmm. which for the most part, this one's taking the lead on. Yes. But I'm actually invested. I'm participating. He really is, guys. It's 2021. I don't completely understand the, oh, I don't care. It's just, it's kind of the most important day of your life up till now, so. <laughs> I don't really care about everything. I think that my involvement goes up to a certain point. And for the most part, you know, I just want her to be able to um, create whatever she wants for that day. What I do care about is the venue. He really does, you guys. And the brief I got for the venue search was nothing in my hometown. His hometown. What else? Yes, it can't be yes. stuffy too traditional in like a colonial mansion or a golf course. Like a country club wedding. It's just not my style. Um, yeah, and we've both noticed that like during the search we've been drawn or have at least had the same reaction yeah. or kind of the same reaction to venues that are kind of industrial like warehouse buildings and you know the spaces that look like they could be like a loft setting i just want something that's cool and unique and something that, that has character that makes an impression so what we decided to do is do a wedding pinterest challenge where we're both going to take about 30 minutes, open up a Pinterest board each individually. Guys, I'm a little nervous because um, I feel like we're gonna come up with two completely opposing, contrasting ideas. So we'll see. So I we'll mean, see. if it comes down to it, obviously, what she says goes. Good man. Good man. <laughs> you know, for the longest time, I always thought like that I would be drawn to the whole whimsical fairy tale kind of princess gown, wedding dress thing, like something very, I don't want to say opulent, but something that literally takes your breath away, like magical. She got expensive taste, y'all. She's describing. Chandeliers. Chandeliers. Cascading flowers and. Oof. So we'll get to creating those Pinterest boards and then we will report back when everything is done and show you guys what we each came up with. Yeah, and you guys have to vote. All right. No, don't vote. I'm gonna look away. Oh yeah, we'll go with this. <laughs> so that you don't see what I come up with. So what kind of wedding are you trying to create here? What's your dream wedding? The colors that I was thinking about are like champagne, but also depending on the season because are we having a spring wedding or are we having a fall wedding? Because if it's a spring wedding, I want like really bright, not super bright, like pastels and stuff like that, but I want like champagne colors, like a hint of rose gold. Not like, oh my gosh, you're wedding, there's so much rose gold, like everything, like the theme looks almost pink. I want some green in there for like, what do you envision for the wedding day? What do you have in mind? What would you like to see or to have? Um, I don't really care. I, I don't really see like the glitzy, crystal, glittery, shimmery, mm -hmm. pink and fluffy. I see fairy tale. Like, where do I fit? <laughs> Let's include like five elements in our board. Right, look, have... I'm just gonna find the things that I think are cool. It has to be specific elements, like specific. You do your board how you want to do your board. I'm going to do my board how I'm going to do my board. You know what I definitely want is I want to have, at both weddings, two signature cocktails. Or for cocktail hour, I would like like a champagne wall where the glasses are mounted on there. I told y'all she likes to spend money. If you don't spend your money, then who will? <laughs> I just want everyone to have a good time. I want us to have a good time ultimately and enjoy it. Because we already know the ceremony is going to be... <laughs> <laughs> Wait, my thing is kind of lit though. Mine is just all over the place, I'm not going to lie. Because I'm just... Uh, he might win, guys. Because I feel like part of me is like, uh, I don't want the pressure of family and friends watching us like 
say our vows and like break down in front of each other. So I'm like, part of me wants to be like, okay, we'll be in this room and you guys will be in the next room streaming what's happening in this room. <laughs> in this room is gonna be me, him, the priest. It's so crazy, you guys. People make me so nervous, but I love people so much. It's weird. Do you think we're gonna have a difficult time like deciding on a cake? Deciding on a cake? Like the flavor? The style, the design, how it looks. Aesthetics, baby. Um, I'll be happy with what you want, except for the one that I know you're gonna choose. Which one? You like the scraped off icing around the thing where it shows through, and I think that looks busted. That's cause you lack style, <laughs> I love. You lack taste. Okay, I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. Okay. So the boards have been made, you guys. This is the D and T wedding board. So we're gonna swap computers and react to each other's boards. Three, two, one. Let's see. Ooh, okay. Okay, They're not too far off. We, we kind of have, not exactly the same, but the overarching theme and like visuals and how we see things is kind of the same. So what I, my mindset, right, was, was to, like I said, I, I like the natural elements to that. I think it would be really cool to infuse like little accents of South Africa in like this elegant wedding. We've been toying with the idea of a, a, a botanical garden wedding in a greenhouses. greenhouses, you know, yeah. where it's a dome, just greenery and fairy lights and all of that. And the, and the, and these soft colors on the flowers, you know, that's, that's kind of something I would love very much. Um, now that would be for the ceremony, but for the reception venue, you know, exposed brick, high ceilings, floor to ceiling windows. We know we can turn into something magical and you know, whatever we want. But this, I'm impressed with this. This was good. I'm happy with how it turned out. I'm happy with what we came up with. We are getting married, y'all. It's not very far off. Oh. Mm -mm. Yeah, we're getting married. <laughs> yeah, this was good, a good exercise. Thank you for tuning in. Um, let us know what you think, just based off of everything that you saw on this video today. Let us know what you think in the comments and don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Turn on that notification bell. <laughs> Thank you for stopping by, you guys. We will see you soon.